Some say he is the successor of Kevin De Bruyne. Others take him to be a refined version of Thomas Müller. And his coach thinks he moves like Leo Messi. Regardless of comparisons, one thing is certain. Florian Witz is going places. Here are six things you probably didn't know about Bundesliga's record-breaking youngster. Number 1. Family business When he made his breakthrough in the top flight of German football, Florian Witz was more concerned about his exams at school than his performances on the pitch, because he knew for a long time that he got the game more or less covered. A big deal in every sense of the word since he was 16 years old, Wirtz leaves any football fan who watches him play in awe. Granted, he is the best Wirtz to play the game, but he is definitely not the first one. Wirtz's father, Hans Joachim, was an amateur football player and the chairman of a local club called SV Grünweiß Brauweiler, the same club where Florian spent the first few years of his career. Now, Hans Joachim and his wife Karin are working as Florian's agents, but their son is not the only footballer in the family. Florian's older sister, Juliana, is also a professional football player. Number 2. A single dream No football player, especially an up-and-coming superstar like Witz, can escape that age-old question. Could you have imagined doing a different job? Shortly after making a name for himself in Bayer Leverkusen's senior squad, that same question was asked to Wirtz, and although his response didn't surprise, it gave the fans a new perspective about how driven the young midfielder was. As it turns out, Florian, along with his classmates, were asked by their primary school teacher to write down the things they would like to do when they grow up, and young Florian was the first to turn in the assignment as his paper simply read, become a professional football player. Number 3. A 300,000 euro bargain Florian Wirtz became a star at Bayer Leverkusen, and he did so while he was practically a schoolboy. But believe it or not, it could have happened earlier. When Leverkusen first came knocking on the family's door, Florian was just 13 years old. The club's sporting director, Simon Rolfes, was raving about the young kid, and he was ready to do everything for his transfer. However, his offer was refused because professional football still seemed far away from Wirtz at the time. A couple of years down the line, Wirtz was playing for Leverkusen's historic rivals, Köln, and this time, they were willing to go all in. Simon Rolfes was now accompanied by CEO Fernando Carro, Peter Bosch, and club legend Rudi Völler in transfer talks. This was the equivalent of an offer one can't refuse. And that's how Florian Wirtz became a Leverkusen player at 16 years old. For only 300,000 euros at that. Talk about the daylight robbery. Number 4. Bundesliga Legacy Shortly after his promotion to senior squad, Florian Wirtz started making a name for himself and his first ever Bundesliga goal helped him a lot on that front. Breaking the previous record set by Nuri Shahin, Wirtz became the youngest ever Bundesliga goal scorer at 17 years and 34 days. He would later be surpassed by Borussia Dortmund's Yusafa Mukoko, but being the earliest goal scorer wasn't going to be the only record he'd set. Wirtz had broken the record set by a previous German youngster, Kai Havertz, and became Leverkusen's youngest player to debut in Bundesliga. Then, a series of goal-scoring records followed. Faster than his rise to stardom, Wirtz became the first player in Bundesliga history to score five goals before turning 18, and also the first under-19 player to score more than 10 Bundesliga goals. As of today, Wirtz is the youngest player in Bundesliga to have made 50 appearances and among the youngest to have made 100, a couple of names after Kai Havertz. Number 5. The GOAT Although he represents Germany, long before he was given the Mannschaft jersey, Wirtz was wearing the colors of another country. Not because he had a family member that made him eligible to play for another team, but because he adored Leo Messi. In fact, 
the Argentinian's number 10 Alpi Celeste jersey was the first ever jersey Verts had in his life. The youngster grew up idolizing La Pulga, and as far as Xabi Alonso is concerned, he must have picked up something from the GOAT along the way. Last year, the Spaniard praised Verts' ability to play the best and the smartest passes more often than not, just like Leo Messi does. Number 6. The Future Florian Verts has a contract with Leverkusen until 2027. But everything he has shown so far suggests that it will be really hard for his team to keep him until then. If he gets to win the Bundesliga, which seems more and more possible after each week, that same task will become downright impossible. Manchester City fans believe Wirtz is Kevin De Bruyne's region. Barcelona fans dream about getting him only because he once said his dream club is the Blaugrana. Even though Wirtz's father said that Leverkusen is the best place for Florian, he too must know that it won't be the case for much longer. Where do you want to see Wirtz play? Will he and his friends go all the way and upset Bayern Munich this season? Be sure to let us know. If you like this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. We'll see you next time.